Live look in Balboa Park, where tonight San Diego City leaders are now in charge of planning the year long celebration to honor San Diego's crown jewel. As we first told you at five, the nonprofit, the taxpayers gave nearly $3 million to organize the 2015 Centennial celebration is now out of business. Ten reporter Rachel Bianco went to city leaders to see where the money is now. She's live in Balboa, uh, Balboa Park, that is, with the unsettling answer and the one person most city leaders are blaming, Rachel. Steve, the centennial celebration is supposed to put Balboa Park on the world stage just as it was back in 1915. Now city leaders have to put together a new plan, and many are saying blame Bob Filner. The centennial celebration was supposed to look like these artist renderings, a year-long bash to honor the 1915 Panama, California Exposition. City leaders say the show will go on, but on a smaller scale. It will not be the $100 million extravaganza that Bob Filner envisioned and did no, mon did no fundraising for. Council President Todd Gloria says the planning got out of control under former Mayor Bob Filner. And really, the year had been spent uh, picking out logos and sort of re-envisioning the event into a much, much larger event. I think the fundraising hasn't gone well because of the uncertainty uh, in the political environment, and I, I just think that uh, that's unfortunate. The Balboa Park Celebration Incorporated formed in 2011. The nonprofit was given $2.8 of taxpayer money and a budget of $50 million to put on the year-long event. As for the nearly $3 million, we don't know how it was spent. I have some serious concerns, though, with the not running turnover records, with the, the money issues and where those dollars were spent. I the nonprofit co chairs released a statement Tuesday evening that reads in part We are grateful for the sponsors and donors who have made financial commitments, but there is not adequate private funding needed to carry out that program as envisioned. The consultants and staff that are on hand uh, were uh, receiving a good, a good deal of compensation. Uh, and again, when I look at this in terms of looking at deliverables and return on investment, they weren't necessarily matching the marks that I wanted to see. The nonprofit went through three CEOs since it formed. It says it will release all of its financial documents to the city. Mayor Faulkner says he'll release plans for a new celebration in the coming weeks. Reporting live in Balboa Park, Rachel Bianco, 10 News.